This is Jordan Tower with JT News, Light News Night, but let's get right into it. Hit that subscribe button, hit that like button. Well, Drake, as we know, he um, he surpassed their the Billboard's Hot 100 record title, and to pay um, respect to them, uh, he he tattooed them on his arm, like an iconic picture of them. Uh, let's see, he's a bona fide hit, hit maker. More slaps than the Beatles, dog. That's what he said. All right, well, I mean, you know, he's put in the work 10 years strong. Uh, and he did this right around OVO Fest. Uh, that's all I got from Drake. I mean, Drake is, I still think Drake on Rick Ross's album, I think he pushed Pusha T off Rick Ross's album saying, I'll take my verse back if you have Pusha T on that song with Lil Wayne. I think he's really mad about that Pusha T thing that happened last year. And it's going to take a while. Now, Rick Ross thinks he's going to do a kumbaya with everybody. He got to stop trying to do that, man. That's like, it's crazy. Anyways, for the juicy news, Omari on April, Little Fizz and his baby mother, Monice Slaughter. Uh, she let all the tea out the bag. Listen to this one. It's crazy. Um, I might have to mute some of the stuff, but whew, it's pretty crazy, guys. Watch. Trying to remove from LA. I have a place in LA, a place in Atlanta, in my home that I own is in Baltimore. And bitch, it takes two. You don't hit me up either when I'm not in LA. So, but I don't have a problem with that. I just know I see you when I come to LA. So you know, he our fucking puppet dog. He he gonna do whatever the fuck she wanna do and and all that shit. So I try to, you know, get backstage well, I gave you backstage backstage um at the Millennium Tour. I, I just go speak to all of them because I'm cool with these okay? I'm cool cool with them and shit. So I go to his room. I'm like, yo, what's up? He tell the security to come up there like, oh I'm getting a massage. I don't know what type of faggy shit you think. Man, nigga, get the fuck out of here, please. Cause I really embarrass you, nigga. Cause I done seen some shit being around y'all. So don't don't go there with me on no bullshit like that. Fuck you and your bitch. I was so mad. I really wanted to really fight both of their heads. Like, get the fuck out of here. I'm not no fucking flute. This is not love and hip hop Hollywood, nigga. So, I don't know. He, he wanna tell me I seen him in the airport the next day. So I'm like, yo, I don't like that phony shit you did. You feel me? Like, if y'all don't fuck with me, that's cool. But don't try to treat me like that in my own city, because I ain't you beat the fuck up. That's on some that's on God. On some real shit. So he like, y'all don't think it's crazy how, you know, April, April just vented to me, you know, how you just left her high and dry. What the fuck you mean, left her high and dry? You you come to me over a bitch that fuck every rapper she come in contact with. Stop playing with me, yo. Really stop playing with me. That shit have made me so mad at one point in time. I'm like, yo, let me just fall back. And, and you know, I ain't never answered, you know, no more. Never reached out to her, none of that shit. So, you know, we haven't spoken in a long time. But he gonna tell me, oh, it was just sneaky. How you try to get backstage and you know you went with April. Fuck is you talking about? That's my, that's my. First of all, I didn't even do the show at an arena. No, I did it at a college. I could walk back any fucking way. Anybody could get backstage at a fucking college, my nigga. So let's step y'all shit up first. Then, I thought we were still cool. I didn't know that your girl was in the feelings like that about me. Like, I'm her bitch or something. No, we was friends. The fuck? Then in the conversation, you gonna tell me, and it's just fucked up because you know a lot of things about us that don't nobody know. We let you in on, you know, this a secret and... When the fuck did y'all think it was a secret, my nigga? Everybody know y'all fucking in, around. Nigga. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here, nigga. And you want a bitch who on live talking about everybody ran up in her pussy and shit. Get the fuck out of here. And then as sad as that shit look, you feel me? Like, this is the person you fighting for a jury, man. Right? That's some clown shit, nigga. You, she a fucking lost cause. The bitch is wild. All, on all types of fucking drugs. Fucking niggas can't even remember the next day and shit. Keep kissing our kids in the mouth. Man, get the fuck out of here, bitch. I'll put you out here. Yeah, bitch, for real. I'm talking about when I was living in LA, you know, when I was up there, staying up there, you know, to shoot this sitcom, this bitch will go out every night. 
guess who the fuck will have her kids? Your baby father. He had her kids more than she did. The fuck with you? Every every opportunity you get, you bashing on Marion. This nigga ain't say nothing to you yet. Nothing about you yet. You look so fucking stupid. And this is the bitch you want to be with. Is you stupid, nigga? She done already told your dumb ass. Like, April told Drew one night she was fucking with ASAP. You know, she was thirsty for this nigga, too. She told Drew, he's my prototype. Like, you can't get them. You know what I'm saying? This is who I want to be with. This is my prototype. They're sitting there looking dumb as shit. Ain't say nothing. So, oh, that this nigga you like, this nigga. Why are you putting up with this shit from one of your band members, baby mothers, nigga? You stupid or no? The fuck? And ASAP playing her. When have I come to the keep having her come to the studio when he got a hell of other bitches that and she's sitting there, she's really, really sitting there instead of leaving. I wish the fuck a nigga would tell me come to the fucking studio and he there with other bitches. Fuck this Ray B. The orgy? Exactly, bitch, and you stupid. Then this bitch really broke down, broke down months, little weeks later after she's saying the um after she's saying a fucking um interview that ASAP did when he said he had a girlfriend. I'm the first person she called. Bitch, he got a girl. <laughs> Yo, man. I mean, it's disgusting, man. That girl, April Jones, is like... Yo. <laughs> Omaria, you had... You, you fell in love with the wrong one, my G, and then little Fizz. He just wants to go Omarion had her. It's crazy. But, um, anyways. I appreciate you guys. That's about it for the night. Um, maybe one more before it's all over. I mean, before the night's over. I appreciate you guys. Sorry for the spotty news. There's not that much going on. Peace.